Master Search Ministries for over three decades has been an impact around the world, reaching out to masses, many of the unreached, unengaged, the downtrodden, the forsaken, God's lilies. God has used us to bring total transformation during times of the famine in Somalia, where we were able to go in against all warnings of our government and bring plumping up to babies that were starving and dying in the desert. 29,000 babies dying within three months time. And we got a charge and a command to go in. And by God's grace, and for our partners and viewers like you, we've been able to go in and bring total transformation, bringing babies at the very brink of death and transforming them into a vessel and a beacon of life and light. One of my most favorite opportunities have been when we had the privilege, invited by the President and the Ambassador at large, to go into Western Sahara, a little tiny remote African nation in Northern Africa, 100% Islamic. There in the Sahara Desert, over 130 degrees scorching heat and freezing at night, we had an opportunity to bring young girls a literacy center and a training and learning center so that young girls in Arabic Muslim countries can have an opportunity to be educated and go to school and now break the systemic chain of poverty. Did you know that 130 million children have never entered a classroom? We're transforming the lives of young kids and children around the world that have never had an opportunity to go to school, neither their parents or their parents' parents before them. And these young kids can go to school for $80 a year. MTM has given them an opportunity to be educated, to stimulate their learning, and our curriculum deals with integrity, character development, and accountability, and nation changing, challenging these young people to understand who they are in Christ Jesus. When the typhoon hit in the Philippines, we knew that we had to move. There wasn't a question ever about our response to go. We were able to earmark pregnant women, babies, and mothers. 82,000 babies were about to be born in the month of January without clinics, without hospitals, and we were able to go in and bring prenatal care and to bring vitamins and clean water to provide for the mothers and the babies. We thank God that we were able to be the hands, the feet, the arm of God extended to those in many remote villages where no one had come. There was no food, there was no aid, there was no help. Total transformation, bringing absolute gospel, the gospel and the light and the love of Almighty God, allowing our light to so shine amongst men that they may see our good works. And in those remote villages, Buddhist villages, Muslim villages, as our light shine, they were able to glorify our Father who is in heaven. There is no place like Southern Sudan. And by God's grace, we were able to go in, in the midst of all the turmoil, and go to the waste, the ruined places, and transform nations into Garden of Eden. The Word of God tells us in Psalm 61 that we are to take former places of desolation, the old waste places, and we have the power to turn them into the Garden of Eden. Through our water projects, I'm so reminded in 2 Kings, the second chapter, the Bible talks about the city whose water was contaminated. One fourth of the world does not have access to clean water. A five minute shower is more water than most people in developing countries have access to in seven days. We're bringing transformation in remote villages like Agosito, Togo, where the village chief and all of his elders were willing to give their lives to the Lord because of a simple, simple, simple gesture of kindness by providing clean water. We thank all of those who have partnered and prayed with us and made all these efforts where we've been able to go in and literally be nation builders, strategists, solutionists, repairs of the breach, restorers of paths to well in, history maker, world changers. It's because of all of those who've partnered with us, this is who we are, this is what we do. Master's Touch Ministries, this is who we are and this is what we do, bringing total transformation to the nations of the earth.